We talked about this before and we'll share it with the fans now. This is no longer a feel good story. It was a feel good story in December. It was a feel yep. good story in January, February with D'Angelo making the All-Star game and them weathering the storms. It is no longer a feel good story. Now there are expectations. They're now, especially with this win tonight, if they don't make it to the playoffs, this could turn into what went from like everyone excited to everyone disappointed, which is where you want to be. You yeah. want to be disappointed. Laker fans, what's going on there? Disappointed. You want that disappointment because it means you had expectations, which is a place that the Nets fan haven't been in a long time. And I think, you know, we talk about this all the time. Culture. Part of that culture is ex expectations. And this Nets team has put themselves in a position to make the playoffs, and that's where they want to be. And Jared Dudley just mentioned it there. For this administration, talking about Sean Marks, Kenny Atkinson, and this team, all that losing that they've done, they came into the season wanting to be a lot better. Right now where you're sitting in sixth place, seventh place, you have a chance to make the playoffs, and they know it's not going to be easy. But what happened tonight, especially in that second half, told you that the Nets understand how big this moment is. And you have to take your chances. When, when Kyrie Irving and Al Harford aren't in that lineup, yeah. that's a game you have to win at home. And to their credit, they did get one more win. Get you to 40, yeah. then we'll work on 41. And, and, and again, another compliment to Sean Mars, Kenny Atkinson, Trangie Langdon, all the people involved. They did a rebuild. And he said he doesn't talk about the season, but if you look at the last three or four seasons with no draft picks. Yep, I know what you're going to no say. No ability to get yep. free agents. And they built this from the ground up, brought in good people, good players, built a team and built a set, basically built an infrastructure yep. that allowed them to get here. And it's it's... It's, it's, it's amazing. It's impressive. Do you also think it wasn't just about player development? They never were in a position where we're going to tank to get a high pick because they didn't have those picks. Yeah. So every night it was, we're going to go out and compete and try to win. I think you're starting to see that, you know, the residual effects of that happening right now with the Nets. And that's when we talked about other players like Devin Booker. You're going out there, putting them back in a game with X amount of time to go get numbers. Th that's not winning basketball. That's no. not winning culture. And that's part of the things that they wanted to eliminate here in Brooklyn. And when, when Sean and, and Kenny took over is like, hey, we're going to go out there and can play because we can't lose because we're not getting our pick. And if we lose, we're actually helping out opponents like the Celtics who who were getting your pick. You're helping out a division opponent. So they did instill the right mindset into all of these guys. And Kenny Atkinson, like I said, we've seen it. Guys like Jared Dudley or uh, Rondé Hollis Jefferson not be in a right. rotation for a week or for 10 days or for two games and then step in and come in and play. That means that you're bringing in people that have the right mindset that are team first and are only focus on the yeah, team. And, and I don't think it's an overstatement to say that when you really look at this organization in the last couple of years, this is one of the biggest wins that they've had because now it's putting them in a position to make the playoffs. And who was the guy that led them there? The guy that they traded for that no one really thought, well, how yeah. good of a player is, became an all-star. And in that second half of tonight's game, 25 points, 20 in the third quarter, dominant performance, great win from the Nets.